Hey y'all, welcome back to Big Sugar. Uh, it finally quit raining long enough and we're gonna try to throw some of this can on there. We do still gotta put throw a pole in, but we'll, we can kick it in afterwards. And I saw it pick up some better concrete since it rained and on all the concrete. But we're gonna cut this and get it all going. We're going to use this new wicked little tool right here for the Dewalt to cut tin because I don't like doing it by hand and I don't think he does either. No. So we'll get a shot of that once we get going. We're going to use this awesome little tin cutter here. Man, that sure hell's beats doing it by hand. It takes a lot of practice, I think, to get the work right. Well, that's the first time we've ever used something like that, at least to me. Man, that's a cool little tool. What do you think of it? Ain't bad. All right. Oh yeah, thistles. That time of year, pick them and burn them. <laughs> I was hoping that it would stay on that way. Might turn your drill up on three. stable enough huh yeah all right we need to find your impact it won't fit on my impact I don't think I mean I could try it I guess it's like any new tool that you've never used before <laughs> Well, it's supposed to go in the holes, but every time I put it in there, it doesn't fit. I mean, we can try it on my impact. Those things do push in. See what I'm saying? Let's see. Let's go ahead and see if we hook it up on my impact and see what happens. We are back. Problems getting this arm to stay on the drill, but I think we got it figured out, so. Let's try her out. Nope. It popped off again. Well, nuggets. I'm just gonna hold it. All right. Well, still, that's faster than doing it by hand. I cut straighter holding it, too, apparently. Eh. All right. We're going to go put tin on. Hey, 
all, welcome back to Big Sugar. Um, here we are putting the tin on. Yeah, this is kind of old used tin, and we had to rechange the roof line and drop it a little bit. When I looked at the tin, I didn't even think about how many, what my ribs were. The valleys do not match up with the ridges up there, so we actually had to drop this roof some, then butt it up to it. So we got a little bit of a extra work to seal up on the top, but that ain't too bad. But uh, it's now just screwing it all down and going. So is that proper tin tire, shorts, and slippers? The slippers part? No. <laughs> the shorts? Most roofers, yes. As you can tell, I'm not a roofer. Or my legs might be a little wider. But it was hot. Let's see about filling the pool up later. Fill the pool up. We're going to come back after we get the rest of this up and uh, we'll see what's going on. 